Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video I will show you a game between Jean Saya Abdumalik and Antonetta Stefanova. This is a game from the Gibraltar Women Grand Prix Tournament 2021. Jean Saya Abdumalik had white pieces and she started with e4. Antonetta Stefanova played e5. Knight to f3. Knight to c6. d4. The Scotch game. e takes on d4. Knight takes on d4. Queen to f6. Knight to b3. Queen to g6. f3. Bishop to d6. Knight to c3. Black to move. Knight from g to e7. This move was seen for the first time in 2006. And black won. But let's take it back. What happens if bishop takes on h2? This looks like a tempting variation for black, doesn't it? Let's see what happens then. Then rook takes bishop, queen to g3 check, king to e2, queen takes rook. It seems that black is doing well. But wait. After knight to d5, and king to d8, bishop to f4, and white stands better. Back to our game. Knight on g to e7, f4, bishop to b4, pinning the knight, f5, queen to f6, threatening maybe bishop takes on c3. Jean Saya Abdumalik ignored the threat and played bishop to d3. Bishop to d6, let's take it back. If bishop takes on c3, check, b takes on c3, queen takes on c3, check, bishop to d2, queen to f6, castling, and white has a compensation for the sacrifice pawn. Back to our game. Bishop to d6, white to move. Queen to h5. Let's take it back. If castling, then queen to h4. That is why Abdumalik played queen to h5 before castling. a5. Castling. a4. What is the best square for the knight? What would you do in this position if you had white pieces? instead of moving the knight. Abdul Malik played bishop to g5, attacking the queen. Queen to e5, bishop to f4, queen to f6. Stefanova would be happy to repeat the position, but Zansaya wanted the full point. Her ambition was to win the tournament. How would you continue in this position? If you wanted to go for a full point, would you save the knight? Abdul Malik played this beautiful move. e5, sacrificing the pawn. Bishop takes pawn. What was the idea behind the pawn sacrifice? The idea was to free the square for the knight. Knight to e4. Attacking the queen, and the queen hasn't got many good squares to go to. Stefanova played queen takes pawn. Black is two pawns up, but behind in the development, and the black queen doesn't seem to be safe on f5. How would you continue? Jean Sayer Abdumalik played. Knight to d6, check. Can you see the purpose of this move? c takes on d6, and now bishop takes queen. The untimely death of the black queen. a takes on b3, bishop takes on e5, knight takes on e5, bishop to e4, b takes on a2. If castling, then uh, queen takes on h7 is slightly unpleasant. Back to our game. 
b takes on a2, queen to d1, rook to a6, bishop to d5, rook to a5, bishop takes on a2, d5, queen to e1, knight from 5 to c6, b4, rook to b5, c3, castling. And black king is finally safe. Maybe. But black has some loose pieces on the board. How can white take an advantage of that? What would you do in this position if you had white pieces? Abdul Malik played queen to e2, attacking the rook. Rook to b6. White played a move. Then black resigned, and the move is b5. Stefanova resigned. If the knight moves to a safe spot, then queen takes the knight on e7. And for the entertainment purpose, let's play a few more moves. Rook takes on b5, queen to d6. Knight to e6, bishop takes on d5, b6, c4, rook to a5, queen takes on b6, rook takes rook, rook takes rook. And perhaps we can stop here. Congratulations to Jean Sayah Abdumalik for winning the Women Gibraltar Grand Prix Tournament 2021. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.